Hello? Okay, well, right here, if you noticed, that I have found an invisible floor. So I was just I was just trying to do another side mission here, so I was looking around, trying to see if I found anything else. So I just see nothing else, so I was looking around. I could find a commentary this so while I did this. Uh, so I was looking to see where else I could go, because there was an invisible floor, so I knew there was something else. So I don't know if there's anywhere to go in here, but I knew you could come down here. I tried to... I believe I tried sliding down behind me. There's like a little area down there. I gotta try that later on. Um, but I went over here to see if there's anything else. Um, I know there's an invisible floor. I think it's like a few more, like right after this, I think there's an invisible floor that you die on. But you know, everyone knows that in a Vex world, that you know, you could always find some places to jump in a Vex world. So I was looking. It's just a random thing. I fell off my sparrow. And I noticed I hit him. My sparrow landed down and it exploded like it didn't keep falling. It just landed and then it stopped and it exploded. So I jumped down. Then I hit the visible floor. So that's where I knew there was a way to get in here somewhere. So I'm looking around. See if there's anything else on this side. I know there wasn't nothing else. Over I was just trying to see if there's anything else. So see, you see it, how low it is? So I know there's an invisible floor. So I knew there was a way to get underneath this map. So, if you can tell where I'm looking at, I'll think later on this, uh, vid you know, this, uh, video, they'll show where I'm at on the map later. So, I don't show it right now, but it'll be shown later. So, I'm just double-checking every area over here, see if there's anywhere else to go. So, this one don't go anywhere. I know that I knew there was an area to go to. I was just checking this area, but I knew there was an area I was going to, you about to see me do it. See how low the invisible floor is? That's where I knew there was somewhere to go, because there was an invisible floor. So I think right here is when I... So I went over here to go look around, you know, to go look on top. Because in the beginning, when you first got into this Nessus, if you uh, spawn into it when you first start doing the game, if you look to the top, you know, when you spawn into the map, there was like a man cannon on the very top when you first spawn into this, you know, when you first got into Nessus. And there was a man cannon on top of, you know, way up on top. And I know usually there's an invisible ceiling that won't let you go up any further. But, like, I'm, I don't know if that man cannon was to something else. But if you ever go back and just respawn back in the beginning of the map, you'll see a man cannon to your top right. And, see, I was just trying to see if there's a way to get up there just to look around. But I'm, So I was, like, going back to where I was going to do because I knew there was an invisible floor, so I knew there was some way to get underneath this map. So I don't know if anyone done this yet, but I'm going to post it to show y'all. Maybe y'all can figure out what to do after this. So I don't really know if anyone really posted it. Someone did after I did this, and you know, but if not, uh, this is a way to get underneath the map, and that's when I figured it out. And then, like, and of course, if y'all done underneath maps, you pretty much, you know, guess where you're going. That's pretty much what I was doing. Just looking around. It's gonna be like maybe like a 15 minute video just to show you. I might not talk through a lot of it, so I'll just probably show you areas that you could go to underneath. So I was just exploring around to go underneath the maps. I think later on you'll see me pop a map up here to show you where I'm at and where I found it. I think I show it later, like if I don't talk during it, but if you see where I started it from, I think I did like um, the last part of this video might be on there if I say something later on it. But you know, this is uh. That way you go to another area, if you, if you had a sparrow. But you can see all the necessary over here. If you look underneath, you'll see the areas that you go to for the maps, for the, you know, the zones that you get for your loot. And then you see the other areas. But as long as you stay down here, you keep spawning down here. So you don't have to worry about spawning through the map. I, mean, I think I did it one other time. Like later on when I did this, I did spawn above, you know, you know, how you usually spawn. Of course, every Destiny player knows that. That you die, you spawn right above the map where you're at. So, I think it did one time after I tried to do all this, after I shown this. But, you know, I'm just doing this, uh, not trying to, like, um, and, you know, really, really find out what to do. Uh, as you can tell, I tried using a sword. But these swords are a lot more different than what we're using, unless I wasn't. But I didn't know if you could get over this. If y'all get that way, right here where I'm trying to get, then good luck to you, because I think I stopped to go look at other places, but I think I tried again. I accidentally hit the right trigger instead of the right bumper, you know, for the melee, for the sword. 
So I'm gonna try it again. Debating how I was gonna do it. I should have changed to my striker. I didn't have my striker, I had the sunbreaker and I didn't have my charge to give me extra boost, so I wasn't I just was exploring. Might hear this real quick. So I don't really know if you can like, you know, like the other map was on for that strike that we used to do on a uh, old Russia kind of thing. Uh, where you stand underneath the zone and you know capture it kind of thing. I don't think you do it on this one unless you unless anyone else that watches this and does something else different do it. I'm um, just showing this. No one has done it yet. I'm showing that you can get underneath the map of Nessus. Cause I found I just randomly found it because my sparrow. Like I said, where I jumped down is where my sparrow. When I jumped off my sparrow to save myself, uh, my sparrow just landed and exploded. Not like totally exploded. You know it just stopped. I was like, wait, that should still be falling. So I decided to fall down. That's why in the beginning you see me dies because I, like, wait, that's an invisible floor. That's how I knew that there's a way to get down here. So I was looking all around from the beginning of the video. So I was looking around trying to see it. And then later on, he'll explain what to do over here and we'll find that on the invisible floor again. But there's probably other areas you could probably, you know, you know, like that right there. We're just showing that. Everyone knows that, you know, you could probably jump on another area when you see that. So I was looking to see where else to jump from. I think I randomly fell and noticed I landed and didn't die. So we'll probably be doing it here pretty soon. So then just going back where I did. I was just trying, like, these areas over here, see if you can land down there. Because, you know, these little ledges here you could probably land on to. And see, that's where the floor starts. So I knew there's another invisible floor. <laughs> so I'm just doing random jumps, just you know. I think I could land right here. I think I landed this. Yep. See, so I landed this. So I was looking over here. I was trying to think of a way to get under there, but I tried sliding and it didn't work. I tried. Maybe someone else could probably do it. I tried to get under there. Cause I'm able to get through there. You know, I just want to quickly show this. I don't think no one's shown this yet. I didn't really look it up yet, so if no one's done it yet, if you did, then just show that's another proof that you can do it. Let's see, there's the other zone you go to to get the loot thing, I think, I believe, or it's quest. So I was just checking random areas. See, that's when I knew that you could get down another part because of the visible floor. Because usually when you know there's no nothing invisible floor, you know you just keep falling and falling and you die. Well, your body just, if it plants like that, you know there's an invisible floor. That means you can land somewhere. So yeah, this video might show me dying a lot, but it's just to show you where you can, can and cannot go kind of thing. I mean, you can follow the way I went, you can find a different way maybe, but this is like one area that you could go underneath this. this. I, I don't know, I think you could do it in this zone, there might be other zones you could do it at, but this is the zone I found it at, so... I decided to land this, I was like, okay, that's cool. So I look around, I was like, okay, I've never been down here, so... I went through another, I went through that invisible floor that was on top, so now... I'm in a different part. actually the same one see this is another one right here so that's when I figure out how to get to the other side so I didn't see this part over here that's when I think I found the visible floor on this side and I'll show you the like the different kind of uh coloration when you look at down the floor where you can see where the invisible floor starts and ends so the place I was Line that. See what I think right here shows the map. So you see where I'm at. It's actually between those two. You see, if you pause it and you can see where I started from. That's where you find to go underneath this map. And I think I believe at the end of this uh, end of this video, 
I'm detecting abnormal vex activity in a local quadrant. I believe at the end of the video, I think I showed again where I ended up at. I think I was like on the left side of that map where I started from. But then I'll show it again, I think, towards the end. See right here, this one I was like, wait, what? I was hoping you'd die and I didn't. It's like, wait, this is different. Because I was actually trying to jump, see where I see that stump there. I was trying to jump on that stump there. And I was like, okay, well, this is cool. And then I was like, wait, I saw the, and if you look to your right, when you pause it right before I fell, you see the, like, the invisible hue. Where you, that's what you're supposed to do. That's when you know that you can't get nowhere because you keep falling. That's when I figured, like, wait, that's, what, there's a visible floor? So I was like, jump in the same area, jump, it's like, okay, taking a risk. And you can see right there, see the divider right there? You can see where the visible wall, or visible floor starts, right here. See? If you look, like, right there, see the line? There's like a line, an invisible line that you can run on. Uh, so I was like, okay, let's see how far this goes. See, you can see the different color. See how it changes? That's how I knew that there's a visible, and that's how far you could go. <laughs> so I touched it. You might be able to jump around that. I'm not for sure. I, am, I don't know if I tried it. I think I might have. But if you look from this stump to that stump and down there, and you can see the different color hue. That's when you know there's an invisible floor right here. And you can see the different color. That's how you know there's a floor right here. So I'm looking around to see if there's another way to go. So I, I think, I, yeah, I believe, I tried to see how far it went this way. But you can see that I was debating what to do because I didn't know which way to go. I don't know how far this invisible floor goes, so if anyone does longer than me, then go do it. So I was just like looking around, and I was like, keep an eye on that line that you see right there. It's right, you can barely see it. It's right there to my right. So I was seeing how far it could go. So I was watching, see where, see there's the corner. You can see the corner, the two different, at the angle right there. I'm across here. I'll probably put my crosshairs on it to show where the corner of it is. It's like right, it's right here. So I'll put my crosshairs on it probably. Here I'm about to put my cross, yeah. So I'll put my cross, where the dot is, is where the corner is. So the corner's right there. That's where the corner stops. So that's where the floor ends. So I turn to my left, I think I ran this way to see how far it goes. So I'm watching out for that line. Pretty sure there might be another one going below because it has to, because if there's that to the right over there, if that's a quest line or you know, a, uh, a zone that you go fine. And I'm pretty sure you get further down. I haven't really tried I think I just did this part just to, you know, it's like show, put it up there. I'm pretty sure you get further down, so I was taking my time because I know where I was going to have an invisible wall stop me from going further out. But I'm pretty sure you get further down, that's to your right, so that's how far it goes. But I'm pretty sure you get further down if you can. I just don't want to spend all my time, you know, Look at this, it was just a random thing I found when my sparrow landed on the ground. <laughs> on the visible floor, that's when I knew to do it. Yep, so that's how far you go. So I'm showing like the area that where it starts and ends from. So I'm going over here, trying to Keep my eye on the visible floor, see which way I go. <laughs> Y'all might be able to get around this and else might be able to get around it, but I'm just saying. Just find areas that you can and cannot go and not do my thing or you can do something different. Let's just show y'all you can get underneath it. See, that's when I noticed there was a divider right here. <laughs> so that, I mean, it took me that long to fall, so there must be, see, look, there's another visible floor. So I was like, wait, there might be another area to go to. So I, I just didn't want to take my time finding it. So but I just showed you there's another visible floor. So there is like a divider on this visible floor to fall further down. So you can see, I see the line again. So I was like, okay, well, I can't go that way. Pretty sure you fall down, you can probably get underneath the floor that I'm on right now and find another floor. I think I pretty much ended I'm about to end this, but uh, if y'all like this one, you know, you can share it to other people, show it around. I'll uh, just show you get underneath the nests. So I think I fast travel out of here, I think. Just to get out of it. Actually, I'll show you where I was at. See, look how far I am. 